humpback whales that travel over 5,000 miles to reach these freezing waters here in Antarctica. They are harvesting quail and they have arrived just in time. Once the ice freezes, the Antarctic crow began to swarm together. That means plenty for the whales. The whales began splitting up into pairs. Diving to the heart of the swarm, teens and whales spiral on each other in close coordination. Now they turn. Blowing air from the blowhorns ascending towards the prey. The quails are totally jarred in, charged from the air bubbles like a gnat. Now, the harvest begins. The feast was short. Summer is short lived, and the whales are to be forced up north once winter returns. Or at least they have food, which is good for them for now. Life here in Antarctica can be tough when it comes to finding food, and that's especially true some animals but if you're smart intelligent enough you may be able to succeed units on the ocean pack hunters are on the hunt Orcas, the most intelligent of all non human predators. They need to eat every day, and that's why they're always on the hunt.
finally I found the favorite prey. Crabby the seals. But there is a problem. They're resting on ice. Such as the orcas can't get through. But the matriarch has a plan. And she gives the signal. Creating a subsurface wave and wasting ice into smaller pieces. However, the seals still have wraps. The matriarch has another trick up her sleeve. <laughs> Working in a coordinated way, the party begins pushing the seals ice platforms up into clearer waters. To avoid injury, the matriarch has one more trick up her sleeve to her plan. Blowing bubbles. This disorientates the tiring seals. And now, they move in for the kill. Many killer whales can the Arctic hunt using this technique. It's one of the more ideal solutions of finding prey here, one of the most extreme habitats 
in the frozen world here on earth.